Good morning. Uh, another literature break for you guys. I'm actually in Seattle in a in a hotel. It's a regular chain hotel, but for whatever reason, there's a um, writing anthology here in the room, which I thought was very cool. So I thought I would share a bit of it with you guys. So this is from What to Read in the Rain. And this is a piece by Mustafa Ahmed. Three things that um, <laughs> it's 7.30 in the morning here, and I'm a little groggy, sorry. But um, it says that his sister inspires him. He's 11 and a half years old, and his friends like that he is funny. Mustafa was born in Aden, Yemen, and speaks Arabic, English, and Somali. So his piece is called I Will Wait for You by Mustafa Ahmed. In my house, there is a chair in which no one is allowed to sit. It's my dad's favorite chair. When he's away at work, my baby sister sits in the chair. If someone else sits in it, she yells, that's my dad's chair. My dad said, I'm the only one who can sit in it. My dad works on a cargo ship. He goes to Alaska where he stays for three months at a time. When he is on the cargo ship, he has to carry heavy boxes and do repairs on the ship. When he is finished with his work, he goes fishing. Sometimes he says that he likes his job, sometimes not. When he's gone, I miss him. It's hard for me to wait three months for him to come home. He buys me almost everything I want. He is so quiet when we are with him. But if there are some people outside of our family, he talks with them. He is short like me, and he looks like me too. My mom tells me that I do things like my dad. My dad likes computers. He also likes to fix things. If anything breaks, he won't wait. He will fix it right away. One day I was helping my dad make something that looked like a triangle box for our garage. When I was passing the nail to my dad, he looked at me and hit his hand really hard. My dad told me to go tell my mom. I went to tell my mom what happened. My mom brought him the first aid box. I miss my dad when he's gone for three months. I miss him because he helps me with my homework. I miss him because he's not there to play with me. I miss him because I am not able to talk to him. I try to keep myself busy with my games or going outside to play with other people. If I sit and think about him, I will be sadder. When my dad is home, he plays soccer or basketball with me. We watch movies. He takes me to GameStop to buy me video games. When I ask my mom to let me go outside, she says no. I think she says no because she's protective of me. But when I ask my dad, he lets me go. So, anyway, that's from, um, uh, that's Mustafa Ahmed's piece from What to Read in the Rain. You guys have a great weekend and um, take care.